Good evening everybody. Today we are going to learn about abscess. What is an abscess? It's a pus filled cavity in our body. If it is in the brain, it is known as brain abscess. If it is in the lungs, it is known as lung abscess. So based on the location where it is in our body, it is decided what it is called. We will also learn about the treatment of an abscess which is called incision and drainage. Basically you make a cut and you drain the pus. So this is our human body lying down and what I have drawn in a square is a block of tissue. So we will try to describe how an abscess looks like. When bacteria infects our tissue there is inflammation around it and this inflammation causes fibrous wall which surrounds this area of inflammation to lock the bacteria in the center and this bacteria in the center cannot go out so it starts filling this cavity with a liquefied tissue by destroying the tissue and creates what we call as pus. Why this pus is important because now the bacteria inside cannot go out but what advantage it gives to this bacteria is that if you give it antibiotics these antibiotics cannot penetrate this wall and what happens is the bacteria stays inside this cavity and starts growing. Treatment of a abscess is incision and drainage in which as you see you use a knife and basically cut the tissue, reach the part of the abscess, open it up and all the pus drains out. And this cleans up the cavity and then you clean up the wall and now the antibiotics can go in and destroy your abscess and the bacteria and your tissue is now healed. That is the treatment for abscess. Now if the abscess is in the brain, it is called brain abscess. If the abscess is in the lungs, it is called lung abscess. If the abscess is in the abdomen, it is called abdominal abscess. If the abscess is in the skin, it is the skin abscess. Basically pus filled cavity. Treatment is the same. You get to the abscess, you drain the pus and give antibiotics. And that's about it.